story all new at 11. A cable company nightmare in one central Indiana community. Tonight, families are dealing with cut gas lines, ripped up yards, and power lines knocked down. Greenwood residents were excited to hear MetroNet was moving in, but tonight they're ready to cut ties with the business. RTV6's Melissa Mahadeo joins us live with how the city is stepping in to protect your family. Yeah, it's hot in Erica. The complaints range from yards being messed up all the way to workers being rude to residents. Now, this suspension coming last night after a reported water line was hit, affecting several residents. It won't take long to notice the typically pristine lawns of these Greenwood residents have been through some work. It's something that we need to address. City engineer Mark Richard says Wednesday night, the city ordered provider MetroNet to immediately stop laying down fiber optic lines after resident complaints added up. We have a uh, number of gas line hits, um, water lines, sanitary sewers, um, I think a couple of uh, electrical lines. Steve Biggerstaff with MetroNet says line cuts happen, but this many is unusual. Well, no matter how well things are done, you are there. There will be opportunity to get in into something, whether it be water, whether it be sewer, whether it be gas or whatever. But you do everything you can to avoid that. It, it, it's a, it's very surprising. What's worse, the city says some residents accuse workers of being disrespectful and taking breaks on their porches. To be honest with you, I was, I was shocked. I was surprised. It took me a while to start. Wait a minute, we're doing that? Actions MetroNet says they will not tolerate and are investigating. In Greenwood, we found several residents also excited about the new service. But for now, the concern for the city and MetroNet will be on cleaning up these yards. We don't want uh, MetroNet to leave um, some of these lawns in a state of disarray. Now, both the city and MetroNet say they are investigating each of these complaints. As of right now, the priority is to fix the look of the area, and then they will move forward from there. Now, MetroNet says that should take approximately two weeks. For right now, Melissa Mahadeo, RTV6 News.